Hi, this is Justin Ratner, Intel CTO, and, um, and this is my contribution uh, to Scenario Land. Um, the, um, I think you know, one of the things that, that has really captured a lot of interest is this, this notion of wireless power. And, and we've been coming at it uh, you know, in, a number of, uh, in a number of ways. Um, our work actually started with this notion of, of scavenging free energy. Um, you know, free radio energy from, you know, from just the environment, from the ambient, uh, to power all sorts of sensor devices. So uh, they would be in, in energy harvesting mode for some period of time. And uh, once they had enough power to transmit, they, um, you know, they'd send out a short burst of information, uh, let's say, you know, providing some sensor uh, data. It could be, you know, temperature, pressure, it could be an image, uh, it could be sound, uh, it could be seismic data, you name it. Uh, more recently, we've been looking at injecting energy into the environment uh, by actually transmitting power intentionally into the environment. Um, and we've been looking particularly at this idea of uh, coupled magnetic um, resonance circuits as a way to transmit power uh, in, a, in a perfectly safe way, uh, not using electromagnetics, but uh, using uh, these coupled resonant magnetic fields. And that's just generated a huge amount of interest, and, and we've gotten, um, you know, all sorts of, of emails, uh, and there have been a lot of blog entries with people postulating what they do with wireless power. But uh, it's really it's really given us uh, sort of new impetus to do the to do the research, and uh, you know, just this notion of, of you know having um, computers and cameras and phones that run infinitely uh, has definitely captured everyone's imagination, I think, both at Intel and in the community at large.